Hey guys and gals, welcome back to another Odd Stars Today's Fun Project. Today we've got a couple things to discuss. Is One, I want to thank you guys for subscribing to my channel and watching all my videos. I appreciate it. I'm about 5,600 subscribers now, so I want to do a giveaway today. And I'm going to put that in conjunction with what we're talking about here. So thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, click down below. Uh, this giveaway, you'll need to be a subscriber. Leave me a comment and uh, we'll get you entered, but I'll have more details at the end of the video. So what we're going to do today is we've got this Golo here, it's called. This is uh, made by Launch. Launch makes automotive diagnostic tools. And what this Launch, or what this Golo does here by Launch is it's a little plug that plugs into your OBD2 uh, port uh, for 96 and newer model cars and through Bluetooth and your cell phone, what you can do is uh, not only get the codes, but you can also erase codes with this. But what's unique to this is you can contact a local shop in the area. So let's say you have a check engine light comes on and uh, you're in an area you're not familiar with, possibly maybe you are home, you're not, you're traveling. Um, get you in contact. This can send that information to a technician who can, I guess, diagnose it over the phone. I don't know, that can be kind of tough at times. Um, or you can even call and talk directly. So anyway, that's basically what this does. It also saves a history of the records in your car or from your, your PCM, ECM to your phone. So if you have trouble codes and it's in history, it'll save it to your phone. Um, let's open it up. Let's take a look at it. So this slides off here. It uh, comes in this clear package. Take it out. Here's the plug, just a simple OBD2. It's got a couple LED lights on the back when it's plugged in. Um, that's as simple as that. Now in the bottom here, the, um, oops, there it is. That's your little top secret piece of paper. So you've got to register this. So what you want to do is it works for Apple or Droid. Um, download the application, you know, like Google Play or Apple Store. And you enter your, uh, I guess it comes with a serial number here. And then you open this up, you got a top secret code which allows it to work, I guess. So once you enter all that good stuff in your phone, it's time to go out to the car and try it out. So that's what we're going to do today. I'll find a, a car out here and uh, we'll, we'll try it out. But anyway, thank you for subscribing. Um, don't forget at the end, I'll give you the information and details to, uh, to win this if you'd like. And uh, let's get to the video. All right, guys, so I decided to use uh, my wife's car as a guinea pig for this thing. So we'll try it up. Hopefully nothing blows up and uh, she won't be mad at me. Anyway, we're in a 13 uh, model Santa Fe. So I guess if you were out of warranty and, uh, you know, you needed some uh, some help on the road, we'll check out this Golo. So I got this OBD2 uh, gizmo right here in my hand, the, the Bluetooth, uh, supposedly, is what it is. And I've got my cell phone here. It's a Droid, uh, what is this, Samsung phone. So I've already, you know, got the app in here. And uh, I see my wife coming now. She, You can't see her, but I think we're going to get a knock on the window any second. Oop, she just saw me and decided to turn around. Come here. Come on over. What? Sorry, I didn't realize you were filming. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? We're going to meet um, Barb at Creation Station at noon. Have Ryan fun. And I are gonna go. Enjoy. You might need to get Haley. I don't See you later. later. Texted Sherry. So. Have a nice day. Well, it's only we're gonna leave in like half hour. So. Okay. All right. Have fun. All right. Okay. Back to work. You're sexy. Oh, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> You're sexy too. Here, I'm gonna put you on camera. No, I don't need to be on camera. <laughs> All right, sexy. See you later. <laughs> All right. So anyhow, um, where was I? Oh yeah. So you get distracted when you get called nice things like that. Let's go back to the app here. I didn't pay her to say that. So we go to the Golo app, open that up. Golo can make your car peace and safety. That's what it said. Okay, all right. So you got, we're at this My Car screen. We got My Car, register, update your vehicle, workshop, submit your request to your workshop. Remote diagnostics, send the remote diagnostic request to make a call. Consult, provide professional vehicle info. Inspect, inspect your vehicle, see if a problem arises. And my report down here in orange, see inspection report on your vehicle. All right, so we got that. Then we got a tab down here that says discover. So I guess you can get messages here. 
they gave me notification let's see there is a message it says uh, dear user your car has not been inspected for over a month inspect it now with an exclamation mark now I don't want to inspect it now uh, contacts what's that enable mobile contacts I guess that's just in your phone book um, technicians let's see what that says okay so it looks like it's opening up Google Maps and um, so we're in Middletown Delaware this is the mid-Atlantic north uh, east area up here let's zoom in so I guess I'm in blue I don't know if you guys are picking that up like right here but uh, that's where I am so it looks like the closest uh, Golo guy is up in Wilmington, which would be, you know, it's 20, 30 minute or 20, 30 miles. So that could be, uh, that could be a lot on them if you're having a misfire. Anyway, it looks like there's a few around Philly, Philadelphia, and there's some in South Jersey. Let's see, here's over here in Baltimore. There's a few guys. Let's see, New York. New York is just flooded with these guys here. I mean, if you're, uh, you're having troubles and you're, here's Delaware, here's where we are. You go down state, here's the beach area, which is pretty popular in Delaware. You know, the Delaware shore right here, the Atlantic Ocean's out here. Um, you're pretty much screwed because there's nobody around. Look at this. There's nothing. This is all the way down into Maryland, down to Virginia. So those are hours and hours away. So anyhow, um, that's that. So let's go back to this my car. I'm going to plug this thing in, and we'll see what we see I have no idea what's gonna happen my Bluetooth is on on the phone alright for those that don't know your OBD2 connectors usually on the driver side down in here this one has a little panel you pull off this has this is model G1002 by launch right there and all you do is uh, take this push it on connect it and you're getting this red and blue LED it made a little chirp sound um, my Bluetooth's on on my phone. Let me go to, I don't know, let's go to inspect. Let's, let's go to inspect. Now, there's no check engine light on on this car, but let's go inspect and see what it does. Your car system has not been inspected. Try it now. So let's go quick inspect. Up here on the tabs, you guys probably can't see this. It says uh, self-help inspect, DTC's clear, and inspection report. So there's no data. Let's go back to uh, quick inspect. Click the blue blue button there. It's downloading something. No car diagnostic software. Please download and install. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna click OK. It says X431 Mini Diagnostics right there. So let's go down. Let's install that. I had to set this, uh, my phone was set up where it wouldn't allow me to install outside uh, software beside uh, Google Play Store, so I had to say okay to that. It says done, application installed, so let's see what happens now. Uh, cell phone Bluetooth switched on, cell phone network turned on, not connected with Golo Box, it says connect, confirm, yeah, let's connect. So let's see what happens. So it says not connected but paired. I don't know. And the red and blue LED on the on the Golo are still solid. Nothing's blinking. So let me see what we got here. I click that. Continue. Confirm ignition switched on, which it is. Confirm the car has stopped. So there's two warnings there. I'm going to click continue. And it seems like it's doing something now. So let's see what happens. Connecting Golo box. Bluetooth pairing request, okay. And now the um, on the Golo OBD box, the red LED started blinking a little bit and then stopped. So maybe we're connected. Uh, it says inspecting 100% inspecting uploading report okay so it's working and uh, would you like to have every 
I'm just going to read what it says here. Would you like to have every of the vehicle diagnostic reports sent to your email? No. And it's got my email address right there. So I'm going to put no. And right here it says no faults in the green view report. No faults have been detected on your car. It is in good condition. Let's open it up and get more details. So it's gave me the uh, Santa Fe 3.3 automatic transmission, serial number, this OBD, not the uh, VIN number. No faults have been detected. Your car's condition is good. Lucky us. Keep inspecting every day. Keep safe driving. All right. That's what it, that's what it says. All right. Um, I don't mind talking like Tonto from uh, from the old days. Fuel, okay, so it gave us fuel and air detector system, ignition system, normal. All this came back normal. Idle speed, computer control system, network connection, others. Okay. Oh, man, we got company here. What do you want, Mr. Goodyear? Hold up, man. Give me give me a couple minutes. I gotta, I gotta, I'm doing a video here. <laughs> All right, hold up. <laughs> Everybody's bothering me today, man. It's Sunday morning. Look, it's 1124. It's, it's, this is the hour here. So anyway, um, so then it gives us the data stream, the number of DTC stored in the CCU, malfunction indicator lamp status. It's giving us a lot of stuff here. Misfire monitoring supported. It says normal. Fuel system monitoring. Normal. Comprehensive component monitoring, compression ignition monitoring, misfire monitoring, fuel system monitoring, wow, um, catalyst monitoring, mon monitoring, comprehensive component monitoring, evap, evap system monitoring, secondary air system, all normal AC system, oxygen sensor, oxygen sensor heater, EGR and or VVT system. Uh, we already did the heated catalyst. It's coming back like twice. So some of these are repeating. Fuel system one, fuel system two, calculated load, engine coolant, short term, long term fuel trim numbers here. Um, intake manifold, absolute pressure, map sensor, engine RPM. Well, it's it's just basically going down the whole list here. Some of these are like I said repeating. Fuel rail pressure normal. It's got GDI, uh, fuel level input. So it's got a lot of stuff here. Uh, how accurate it is, I don't know. Type of fuel currently being utilized, you know, if it's a E85 deal. So it, it, it seems to monitor a lot. Let's see what else we can play with. The LEDs are still solid on there. What's this down here? Expert diagnose, diagnostic. For any problem, about your car contact expert to remotely diagnose it and it says no link shop link now let's just hit it just to see what happens somebody will get a free plug I guess so they got you know like here's a guy named Chris professional Amazon um, I don't know any of these places any of these shops here I've never heard of now look this this is up in this one's in Jersey which would take like 45 minutes. Maple Shade, which that's like an hour, 15 minutes away. Um, these are all up in Pennsylvania and in New Jersey. They're not even close. So, you know, that wouldn't really do me much good if I wasn't uh, fixing my own junk. But anyway, so that's that. So I guess it could help you out if you were in a spot where you didn't know where you were, you know, and um, try to find you some help. Give me one minute, man. I got to finish filming this. Huh? I got to finish filming this. Huh? What are you doing with these vehicles? What do you mean? You got to restate your water mile here. You ain't <laughs> even selling no dog. You better sell one of these two vets if you want to go to that car place. The red one's for sale. Well, bring it out. Right there How much you want to give me for it? Hey, I'll give you 500 <laughs> or 600 <laughs> Give me 600 for that? Dude, that's a nice ride, though. But I'm saying, you should put them joints out front. That would be a deal, man. 
Hey, you all right. You wasting gas? You know that, right? I am wasting gas. Well, Let no, me finish no, this no, video, man. This thing is this thing is leaking. Well, that's the air conditioning. That's the condensation dripping. What you gonna do with the uh? Does the bike run? My boy was talking about. Yeah, when he gonna bring his bike? I was like, I don't know. You come down his crib. He seen these three sitting in the driveway, and then he didn't see that truck right there. He's um. Like, He's like, tell my boy to come bring the bike out. I'm going to race him. Like, where? Down there on 13. I'm like, yo, with all that traffic down there? You weaving in and out of that traffic? Yeah, he was weaving in and out of traffic. I was like, yo, where you going, man? She's like, man, I'm going to work. I'm like, yo, hold up, dude. He said, um, he know you fix vehicles. He wanted you to come over his crib and fix his car. I have permission to put this conversation on YouTube, right? Yeah, go ahead. Thank you. Mr. Like, Goodyear. He was like, yeah, when are you going to fix his, uh, fix my car? I'm like, hey, if I call him, tell him to come down, he, he got I'm, a trailer. So you got flies and bees and stuff coming in your garage? <laughs> like, what the <laughs> f***? You ain't working on something? It's all good, man. What happened to the other video you had? Which one? one I got a lot of them. No, the one that you was working on cars. Remember you was doing one in there and you said, oh, I got to do something with my car? Yeah. I think it was this one here. Yeah. Is it a truck? It could have been. Yeah, he was like, I want you to work on it. He got a car just like this. He wanted you to work on it for him. He thought you was coming down there to fix his car. His car is in the street. It's sitting on the side of his crib. He wanted you to come down and fix it for him. All right, man, let me finish this up. Go ahead. Give, give me a minute. Just in there. Go ahead. I gotta, no, I got to do it out here. I'll be right, I'll be right with you. Back up. Give me a minute, man. Today's fun project. Today's fun project. All right. Mr. Goodyear had a lot to tell us there, but anyhow... I guess if you had a check engine light on and you didn't know what was going on, you could get into your phone here, find out what trouble code it is, look it up. You could contact the shop, you know, hit workshop. It'll call that shop, you know, if they're open, they're open. It's like hit or miss, I guess, right? And they could say, oh yeah, you know, go tighten your gas cap or uh, you got an engine misfire or what have you. I don't know, you know, whatever it is and give you some guidance direction to, to get the, uh, you know get it solved so basically it's like any little scanner it's like a little scanner on your phone here that's that's what it is but it has communication ability to text or call the shop directly and it does have this my report which in here which is kind of neat because it could keep track of when you've checked your codes or what codes you had diagnostics you could clear the DTCs so let's find where that is here. Inspect. I think it's under inspect. I saw that. So right here, um, up top, you probably, you guys probably can't see it, but it says self-help inspect DTCs clear. So you could quick DTC clear all DTCs cleared, and uh, here's your inspection reports. So it came back. Let's see what this says. Quick inspection report. Yeah, that's basically what we just looked at earlier. And it says report reply. So, and now there's something here with reward, rewarded credits. So I read that somewhere. If you check your, if you use this thing every day, they give you credits. So, but um, it says tips. After increasing rewards, more users will see your question. Oh, okay, so you can ask questions and get them answered somehow. After the question is answered, you can choose to accept the best one. <laughs> Otherwise, the rewards will be evenly assigned to all. So, yeah, it's kind of like a video game setup. All right, so much for that. And uh, I think I'll shut the car off now. Well, hopefully that gave you some idea how this GOLO works for the diagnostics if you're on the road or even if you're at home um, to get in contact with the shop. Personally, I think if you had your cell phone and you could look that information up with Google, you know, it, it's pretty pretty easy to do with your cell phone. But for some people, I guess this would work better for them. They'd be more comfortable that way. Then it's fine. Launch did not pay me to do this video. They mailed this to me, asked me for an honest review. And, uh, you know, it works fine. It seems like it, it was a little tricky to get set up with the Bluetooth. But once it got going, it was going. You know, it was fine. Um, I am going to do the giveaway. I'm going to give this away. So all I need you to do is be a subscriber to my channel and uh, leave a comment down below. Even if you don't want to be in a contest, you can still leave me a, content, uh, a comment. And uh, the code will be, we'll use what I use to open my videos with, Today's Fun Project. So if you just put Today's Fun Project down there in the comment section, whether it's with the comment or not, you'll be entered. 
We'll put your name in a hat. We'll draw one lucky winner out. And this is yours. I'll mail it to you free of charge, no cost. So uh, to give back, I appreciate it. Thank you very much for watching, subscribing, and uh, continue to uh, check out my future videos. So anyway, uh, I guess that's about it. We'll wrap it up. I'll see you on the next one. Take it easy. Oh, I'll get it right. I'm going to get it right this time, man. I can feel it. Today's fun project.